Hello YouTube. Uh, my other videos, I showed you that I uh, bought new struts, uh, new uh, springs, and uh, I almost going to install them on the vehicle. Now this is the back. As you can see, it sits pretty good. I already put about almost 1,500 miles on the back, so they settled down. So this is the lowest it's going to get. So it sits pretty good. Uh, I did the backs first because they were in really bad shape so I did those first and I kind of weighed it to do the fronts because it was more labor intensive. Uh, the fronts are on now. As you can see it sits pretty high. It will settle. I'm going on a road trip this weekend to California. That's about about 1,300-1,400 miles one way. When I get back it should settle down another inch or two. But uh, that's not the issue why I made this video. The issue was the chamber. Because I do my own alignments. Uh, I'd rather do it myself than pay somebody a couple extra bucks to do it. But uh, as you can see here, the passenger side chamber was pretty well. It's just straightforward. Uh, I got those into spec. But the other side... I couldn't get in spec regardless of what I did and then I did some research and he said I might have to get an adjustable top plate a chamber a camber uh, kit to get it within specs but I decided to go another way another route a cheaper route so what I did was I drilled out all the spot welds there's a couple here there's one here there's a couple more one on the other side once I went once I drilled out the spot welds this whole piece will be adjustable so then I can just get it into spec tighten everything back down cheap fix it took me about 20 minutes and about one drill bit but I had it done as you can see here I drilled out the spot welds Boom, boom, boom. This whole piece is able to be moved. Um, so I was able to get everything in spec. I tightened everything down. And everything, so far, so good. It tracks perfectly. No wear on the inside tire. Uh, so basically that's done. I'm going to clean this up a little bit. It's a little bare metal there. I'm going to clean it up a little bit. Flatten this down right here. Throw a little paint on it, match the body, and you won't even notice that I did the modification on it. But that's just something I needed to make a video of to show that everything is not straightforward, even when you have all the parts. Sometimes you gotta do a little modification here, a little adjustment there. Until next time, I will make another video. And uh Enjoy your car. Work on it. Have fun. Make it your own. Till next time.